Now we are going to take square roots in a different way, the difference being that this process only works for answers that will result in two-digit square roots. So we'll begin with the number 1764. And here we have it. Now the first step is to find a number which will represent the first digit of the square root that when squared is closest to 17. So that is 4 because 4 squared is 16. So we'll just represent that square root number over here. Now, the middle we'll use for scrap work. As 4 squared is 16, we'll have 1, 5, 1, that's 16. And now we have to subtract 16 from 17, which obviously just leaves 1. The next step is to take the original 4 and multiply that by 2. I just got rid of the scrap there. So 4 times 2 is 8, 5 plus 3, and now we have to see how many times does 8 go into 16. So 8 goes into 16 2 times, so that will actually be the second digit of our square root, 2. So once again, 8 times 2 is 16, and we can just represent that over here. This 6 and 16, and 16 subtract 16 is 0. And now we can verify that this is indeed correct, as 2 squared gives us 4, so we can subtract that and we are done. You can see that this number did not need to be changed in any way. As long as it's done correctly and it's squared at the end, it should result in the final digit. So now we'll do a second example. Let's get rid of this. And we'll take the square root of 3364. So there we have it. Now we will find a number that when squared it is closest to 33, and that would be 5. So 5 squared is 25, so I'll represent that here. Now subtract 25 from 33, which leaves us with 8. And I'll get rid of this strap. So 5 times 2 is 10. Oh, I'm sorry about that. So this can be representing 10. And 10 times what number will be closest to 86? That is 8. So we'll put 8 over here. And we are left with 8. So now we will subtract 8 from this column, leaving us with 64. And we can see that 8 squared gives us 64, which is over here. So we subtract that. And we have the correct answer. So 58 is our answer. And that's all that this method requires. Thank you.